Hey, Eric Ware with Reserve Tastings here for another wine review over a little, uh, what do we got here? A little spicy garlic lime chicken with some sauteed spinach. So let's do this quick because I'm kind of hungry. Got the 2015 Kirkland, which you can get at Costco, Chablis Premier Cru. Saw that and I had to grab it because it's not easy to find Chablis at the $15 and $20 price point. It was actually more towards the $15. So let's do our four S's, which is Sight, Swirl, which I'll swirl a lot through the whole thing. Uh, smell, and then savor or sip, right? So sight, other than it being cold, uh, it's clear. They call it kind of like a star bright. Uh, it's got a little, you know, it's got a little yellow tinge to it. Now that I look at it, a little, little bit, which 2015, yeah, it shouldn't have that, but that's fine. It's not very expressive. Not a lot of the nose coming out. What you look for in Chablis is kind of like pear, um, sometimes a little lemon comes out of it, like a lemon rind, but definitely pear and usually like a harder pear. Not such a ripe pear, but more of a, a solid pear. Just a little bit, a little bit. Mm. Not bad, but not fantastic. I'm gonna give this about two and a half glasses. That's what Eric would drink of this tonight. I like how I refer to myself as Eric. That's nice, man. Um, the reason why is because it does have that pear um, but the lemons really just disappeared. There's no citrus on this at all. There's no brightness. The acidity is kind of muted. It's a nice glass of wine. Uh, if I was doing a blind tasting, I wouldn't pick it up as a Chablis. But two and a half glasses, and I think you'll enjoy it, especially a Costco uh, find. So cheers.